and welcome back to my channel. I was finally able to make it down to Gasparillo Mall to check out JD's and I came back with a big, actually two bags, but the makeup in one bag. So I have all these goodies to show you. <sighs> what is that? Okay, let me show you the makeup wipes first. Um, I had an issue with Pennywise, so I know I, will, I wasn't going back there anytime soon. So I picked up my makeup wipes and JD's. This is the Fresh and Soft, and this one is Beauty Formulas Gentle Soft Apricot Cleansing Facial Wipes. This was seventeen seventy-five, and I think this was between seven and nine TT dollars. And the rest of things, just makeup, makeup, makeup. So I wanted a new mascara and it was between the Maybelline Big Eyes and the L'Oreal. I ended up choosing the L'Oreal Miss Manga and I wore it over the weekend for a wedding. And I love it. I will have to do a, a demonstration or something. This is really amazing. I love the shape of the brush how it tapers down you see I have small eyes so this tip here can really get into the corners I really like this so I'll probably do a review I also started using this this is the Maybelline baby skin instant pore eraser I know people don't like this if they have oily skin but my skin is can be dry but um it's settling into normal right now so this works good for me Let's see if I could find the sizes. <laughs> this is so old it's starting to erase because I had the stuff just waiting until I finish exams before I um started filming again. L'Oreal Miss Manga was $59.75 and let me see, Maybelline. This was $43.50. I know um, it's probably like a few dollars more in Pennywise, but that's just some items. Other items are really affordable. I have lashes from my Yips haul in here. I don't know if I showed you. These are really ex inexpensive, seven dollars or seven fifty. Oh, I picked up this another Arista palette. I have one in the neutrals, so I picked up one in colors, and this was I think twenty one. Really nice. This is a Wet n Wild trio in spoiled brat. I had the full collection, but I gave this one away. So I just picked it up to have my full collection again. And spoil brat. I think this was twelve dollars. Could be twelve dollars. A lot of the the whole wet and wild stand, yes, everything on the wet and wild stand was twelve dollars. Which is really great because in Starlight it would in Starlight this was probably twenty something or even thirty dollars. So anything wet and while they see me pull out will be $12. So this is a lip liner, color icon lip liner in Willow. And more wet and while. This is the Mega Glow Illuminating Powder in Catwalk Pink and strike a pose rose I have not used these bag is empty now this is a single eyeshadow in it's not saying the name ah, it's a pink I have none of these, this is my first one, and this is a lip shimmer. 
Natural Blend Lip Shimmer in Cinnamon. I still have more stuff in my box. Oh, I picked up. They had a um, Sasha stand as well. So I picked up one of the blushes. This is Indian Rose. Me. My name is Rose. I don't know why Sasha puts these ridiculous... What is this? This could never work for this. Makes no sense. Alright, so that's a Sasha blush. Let me check the price of that one. Sasha blush. Could be 30 something dollars. And Sasha blush. $38.99 What else I have from Sasha? Yeah, this is a Maybelline eyeshadow quad in autumn couples. I also use this during the weekend for a wedding. And this is my first Maybelline eyeshadow. This was oh it's called a smoky quad. And it was $36.75. If you want to see a get ready with me using this, leave a comment below. I'll do that for you. More Maybelline stuff. I picked up two of the lipsticks um, that I really wanted after seeing some reviews on swatches. This one is Vibrant Mandarin and Shocking Coral. These are from the Vivids. And I was really into kind of coral orangey lips. And these are nice and creamy. So this is Vibrant Mandarin. And Shocking Coral. Gorgeous. Have not worn these as yet picked up an Arista blush in Sahara really intense color blends out nice this would look great on um, deeper skin tones as well how much was it? This blush was... Where's the blush? I think it was... Okay, $21.50. $21.50. It's usually $20 in other places. That's okay. I have some more Wet n Wild. Two lipsticks. This one is... Make Me Blush, it's a brownie nude and birthday suit, so two kind of nude shades and these are steeled. And some Revlon, I love these Revlon lip glosses, so when I saw them I grabbed it up because um, the issue with Pennywise now as they put all out on the stand, I will not be able to get them perfectly sealed because people are taking them, opening and putting back on the shelves. So as I saw them in JD's, I grabbed them up one time. This one is super natural. A gorgeous, gorgeous nude. Love this. And this one is Berry Aloo. And Ramel. This is the Show Off Lip Lacquer. I really love these. I was wearing um, Apocalyptic in a previous video, you'll see. And this one is Galaxy. And they had a good selection on these. Almost all the colors. Galaxy. Uh, 
Um, the last few things are soft touch cosmetics, which I got really reasonable. The pencils were seven fifty, and the pigments were nineteen seventy five. That's really great because pencils elsewhere are ten and um, pigments are twenty five. So I got them really good price. So pencils I picked up. This is a nude or brown nude, medium brown, and they're sealed, so I can't swatch them for you yet. Medium brown. This is love that orange. This is dazzle me gold and rose red. Anytime I see my name, I just have to pick it up. I don't know, I just crazy like that. This is nice though. So four pencils and I'm seeing three pigments. No, two pigments. This is one previously. I use this for the wedding. This is my tan pearl, which is gorgeous. Everybody should have tan pearl. Love it. So what I got at JD's was Igona Green and Lover's Paradise and I think that is everything for this haul you can see my huge bill and this was a while ago because um during exams I wasn't really shopping and anything I didn't go anywhere exams are over now I had exam on the 3rd of June but right after I had a wedding to go to and I was pretty busy I only got some time to sit down and actually film for you right now and I will be busy again I have to register for the next semester so I hope you guys enjoyed this enormous beauty makeup haul from JD's and if you want to see any reviews or anything please let me know